Sir, may I ask you uh, briefly, the BJP and the left are now saying the government should withdraw its own bill and in a sense uh, go back to the drawing board or present Anna Hazare's bill to the standing committee and then parliament can in a sense take it from there. So other people have suggested bypassing the standing committee saying it has been done in the past. Do you believe the government should withdraw its own bill? Well, standing committee, if all parties agree, the standing committee in a day can adopt the non Lokpal bill and let the at least the process of uh, lawmaking be followed. After all, standing committee system has been, has, de has been developed just because of this, that it cannot be discussed threadbare in the parliament from the floor of the house. Therefore, all these important legislations should go to the standing committee where members of all parties are represented and they took, take time, take evidence, take materials, they invite people to come and give evidence before them and then formulate a proposal. Now, if everything is given a go-by because some people are on the streets, then I believe it's the end of parliamentary democracy in the country. Therefore, let us all appeal to Mr. Anna Hazare, please give up the fast, please send your people to the, uh, the table for discussion. Okay. And I'm sure, may not be within 30 years, but within a reasonable time, something will be arrived at. Otherwise, I don't know, there will be total chaos. And I, I shudder to think what will, what will be the, the effect on the people as a whole. Now, in future, any and every law will have to be passed if 15 lakhs of people can gather at Ramlila grounds. Yes, then they... I don't know who selects this. Yes. yes. No, no, sir, you're absolutely right. These are Therefore, the... I do not know. Of course, I do not wish to say something. But India is not a country of 20 million people. It's 120 crore people in this country. Then yes. what, will, what will happen? Yeah. Who, who's, whose opinion is being now stated to be the country's opinion? We are being told that Janamath is for it. What, how do you assess Janamath? It's a very important then point. Either election, That's been suggested. Uh, will, will the country go to election in two and a half years? When the ruling party has majority in the house. So then any and every government can be asked to go away. Please, please don't bring India to such a situation. It's such an important, which after all, 300, 200 years of subjugation, we have become independent. 63 years, we should have done much, much better, I agree. I, it is very, this government goes, then who will come? The, to the opposition-run government will come, BJP's and his courts, or there will be new election. You, would, you have to have a government in the country. There cannot be president's rule in India, in the center. So who is thinking of all this? I don't know. Well, I am out of it altogether in the sense, except as a citizen, I am not directly concerned. But as a citizen, I am entitled to Absolutely, express sir. my concern. Absolutely, I'm sorry. sir. Absolutely. I'm sorry that this is being happening. Yes. And you Therefore, my appeal to all, please save the country. Please save the constitutional, the setup which our forefathers, the founding fathers, had decided after three years of deliberation. It should not be treated that democracy, parliamentary democracy, is so fickle that it cannot stand the pressure of 15 lakhs or 20 lakhs of people. Of course, the... The, the system the, with the help, at least media is projected it. I wish it had been little more, little muted. However, that's different. Thank I do not wish to comment yes. upon the media's right. No, rights. but sir, your points media are very well taken. Media has got right. No, but sir, your points are very, very I, well taken that this is about preserving the institutions of democracy and we have to remember that we yes. are a functioning democracy and never lose sight of that, no matter how serious the crisis is. Somna Chatterjee, thank you so much for your very emotional yes. and uh, cerebral uh, all at once appeal there. Somna Chatterjee, former speaker of the Lok Sabha, saying that you have to remember that India is a country of more than 1 billion people and 15 to 20 uh, uh, thousand people gathering every day or even 15 lakh people uh, cannot subvert, in a sense, the institutions of democracy while he has great respect for Sri Anna Hazar. NDTV's cricket app, Android and iPhone, faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free NDTV.com/apps.